Hi, in this video I'd like to show you how to measure an existing garment to make the same measurement of garment in a knitted item. So we're going to draw a schematic and it doesn't have to be fancy, we're just going to copy what we see at, on the shirt. I'm going to use a lightweight t-shirt because my garment is going to be lightweight. If you're going to make a heavyweight garment, you're measure, you should measure a sweatshirt or an existing sweater. So we're starting out with the neck, shoulders, armholes, body, sleeves, and back neck. If you wanted to make a v-neck or a square neck, you would draw it in like that. So the first measurement we want to take on our garment is the underarm measurement, excuse me, the bust measurement from underarm across. We get 18 and a half inches. Mark that on your schematic. Then measure the lower edge of the garment across, 19 and a half inches. Measure the width of the upper body of the garment from armhole to armhole, 16 inches. And then measure the back neck distance width, without including the borders, seven inches across the back neck. Next, we wanna measure the lengths of the garment. First, we'll start with the length from the cuff, lower edge to the underarm, 15 and a half inches. Then measure the armhole depth from the shoulder to the underarm, eight and a half inches. Then measure the depth of the neck drop. And our sweater is not going to have back neck shaping like this, so I'm gonna measure straight across, not including the border, three and a half inches. And measure the length of the sleeve. Doesn't matter whether you're making a long sleeve garment or short sleeve, you're gonna measure from the underarm to the end of the sleeve, three and a half inches. Mark that on your schematic. So that is all the measurements we need to create a garment, a knitted garment in your size to fit however you want it to. So this is easy and fun. You should try it.